Did you have the baby yet? Do you want me to come over there and sit on you? Because I'll do it. What are you doing here so early? They sent me home from work. They were like, start your maternity leave now. Just rest. Get ready for the baby. Well, you know what? Screw them. They don't want me there. I'll just hang out with you guys. Or you could do volunteer work. Hello. Joey, it's Estelle. Great news. I was able to get you and one guest tickets to your premiere. One guest? You told me I could have six tickets. Well, I sold four of them on eBay. <laughs> You'll be sitting next to Hot Guy 372. Oh, my God. So that's it? I only get to bring one guest? Yeah. What time you want to pick me up? <laughs> Hello? You hear that? I only get one extra ticket to my premiere. So somehow I have to pick between you three and Ross. What, what, what about me? You said you didn't want to go. I don't. But I would still like to be acknowledged. What, just because I'm pregnant, I'm invisible? You're definitely not invisible. <laughs> well, you know, Ross didn't care enough to be here, so I think he's out. You know, you snooze, you lose. He's not snoozing, he's teaching a class. Well, then somebody's snoozing. <laughs> and, and, uh, Joey, not that this uh, should affect you at all, but um, if you were to pick me, I was planning on wearing a sequin dress cut down to here. I haven't seen this dress. Star in a movie. <laughs> Joey, you pick whoever you want, okay? You just listen to your heart. What does it tell you? Beep, beep. Fifi. Well, uh, I think I want to take Chandler. Fifi, 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 Fifi. You really want to take me? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm sorry. I wish I could take everybody, but you know, Chandler's always supported my career. He's paid for acting classes and headshots and stuff, and well, this would be my way of paying you back. So you're never actually going to pay me back? <laughs> hey, just because he paid for your headshots, you're going to take him? Joey, I don't think you're comprehending just how slutty this dress is. <laughs> it's not just the stuff he paid for. I mean, it's, it's, it's everything, you know? He, he read lines with me. He, he went with me on auditions when I was really nervous. And then he consoled me after I didn't get parts that I really wanted. You always believed in me, man, even, even when I didn't believe in myself. I always knew you were going to make it. I'm so proud of you. Thanks. That, that means a lot to me. Come on, maybe one of these guys wants to wear your dress. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to go shave. <clears throat> yeah, well, I'm going to go uh, spit. <clears throat> To pee. If I don't come out in five minutes, it's because I've choked to death on the potpourri stink. <laughs> when she comes out, you hold her nose, I'll blow in her mouth, and the kid will just right out of her. <laughs> She's over a week late. She's got to have it today, right? I don't know. I, I think it's still going to be a while. Mm. Care to make it interesting? <laughs> I bet you that she'll have it by this time tomorrow. You're on. Okay, how much? One hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> how about fifty bucks? Fine, I'll call Zurich and move some money around. <laughs> All right, whose turn is it to help me get up? <clears throat> no one's here. <laughs> oh, damn it. 